to swell with clouds and planets bright and clear. The waters that do flow, do flow but far and near, and this the firmament in the centre shall be here. Under the heavens, and also above, the waters shall clearly be seen, and this shall all my nature prove by making creatures of nature clean. More such a work shall now I try, that they may be of use to all. All the waters under the sky that have been set, both great and small, now flow together, so say I, into one ocean and one whole, so that the dryness may appear in valley deep and mountain tall. You, dryness, land shall be. This name I shall be called, and you I name the sea, the throng of waters all. The earth shall flourish, nourishing, as I do bid, obediently. The herbs and every other thing that grows and waxes worthily. Also the trees from thence do spring with boughs and branches spaciously, and flowers fair on high to hang, and fruit for food abundantly. And when the green ripeness see the fruit most beautiful in sight. Then the heavens, rain and winds, I soon shall send away in flight, and from their seeds then soon new roots shall rise more bright. From my great goodness now shall flow, to guard my works and keep from dread, two lights, one greater and one less, to set within the firmament. The greater light, I say, for the day shall it be meant. The lesser light, I say, to night shall it be sent. Greater light, I name the sun, to drive the dark from down and dale. All of my works I have begun, him will then will he govern, great and small. They be closed with cold, then soon the light from the sun shall make them hail. Sun and moon in man of fair, now suitably go in your decree. For you shall mark the seasons here, that everyone in each country, from day to day and year on year, by certain signs shall surely see. The heavens shall be replete with stars in great plenty. Within the seas, I know shall set the whales with vigour for to dwell, and other fish with fins for to flit. Some with scale and some with shell, and other kinds more varied yet, in fitting manner to teem and swell. And also, up in the air on high, 
your name shall be. Oh Lord, have marvellous is your light, and that we see on every side, for here is such a joyful sight to see those of this world so long and wide. So many things here and I see, birds and beasts both wild and tame, but none are made like unto you, unto thee, for we alone are be your name. Thank you. 